Hey there YouTube, I'm not so super prize and today we are playing Skyrim. This is take two of this video. Because I glitched the quest and accidentally broke it. So this is my second attempt at this video. And I'm hopefully not going to mess up this time. So, we are in Riften. <laughs> We're looking to make some money for our mad like crew shenanigans. Because last episode we tried to murder and well... That went about as well as you'd expect. So we're in Riften, the money-making capital of Skyrim. Perfect for a mad lad cri Where's Lydia? We have lost Lydia, haven't we? Guys, I told you to look after Lydia. She is a wild one. Like, she's a loose cannon. She will disappear on us. God, have you seen Lydia? That's what happens. Oh, Lydia, they're there. You're there. Good, good. Right. So, my mad lad crew, we need to make some money. Who's got where are you going? It's not that scary. Here. See? It is absolutely harmless. You might break your neck, but other than that, you're fine. So, we need to make some money, group, my crew. So, what do we do? Any ideas? Lydia? You're usually full of ideas. Anything? Nope, you're just in the eyes. Vigilant, space boy. How do you feel about prostitution? God, could you get lost? I don't like you. Scootaloo, you're... Alright. Anyway, let's go. We need to find a way to make money. Surely there is a fine gentleman somewhere that can help me make some money. Dude, I have like 1,500 gold. I have no money. I'm poor. Like, I basically live in the streets with my group here. I'm saying you've got the coin. How could you possibly know that? I'm a Daedric Prince. I could have all the gold I wanted if I modded it in. My wealth is none of your business. Crew, I think we have a job. Sounds like a plan. What do I have to do? Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're going to steal Medesi's silver ring from Strongball under his staff. Once you have it, I want you to place it... Alright, that sounds easy enough. And if there's anyone around, I'll launch them. There's Why plant the ring? Wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. Now, you tell me when you're ready, and we'll get started. All right, let's get this started. Wait until I start the distraction, then show me what you're made of. Easy. Right, crew. All right, crew, be a good distraction. My husband, Darcy, will be the judge. He spends too much time worrying about whispering, not enough about himself. Okay, right. Apparently there's someone that can see me. Oh, the guard. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh, wait, someone's just seen me. What is this thing called? Ancient Francais. All right. Oh. And got it. Right, am I still good? Still good. I wouldn't want you to get left out. All right, Lydia, you're doing good. That's what you said about the witch bag. And it turned out that it crushed your roof next to the quarry. Had to. I, I had to do it. Right, so, there we go. I I think I might have just accidentally taken their clothes. Uh, where is it? Modesti Silver Ring. There we go. In fact, I think you actually can pickpocket people's clothes off them. Like, literally, you could walk up to someone and literally just go, and just take their clothes, and they'll be like, Okay. Keep your uh, hands down. I'm sure that is a perk. I've got to check this now. Like, I need to make sure that I'm actually not going to do lally. Is that actually a perk? Uh, poison. Pickpocket goes easier. Carrying capacity. Uh, uh, yep, can pickpocket equipped items. So, yep, I could literally steal people's clothes. I could literally just rip their clothes off them uh -huh. and they wouldn't bat an eye. Like, I chose the right like that's a weird perk. And here you go. Your payment. Just as I promised. 
So that yeah, that is a thing. Anyway, we did it without a hitch because we're pros at this. So what's been going on? My organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. Well, give me more than 100 gold and I'll be happy. Let's put that to the test. The group I represent has its home in the rat way beneath Ripley. A tavern called the rat Oh, you mean that place I was at the last episode where I launched Delta of it 14 times? You've really got what it takes. You mean the place that I've got to already? I launched Delvin. Oh, by the way, bring you off. Here's what I think you're 100 gold. Get fucked. Hey, the, the guys, chill. Chill. Wait a minute. I gotta do something. Can I launch you over that wall, please? You're not getting a choice in the matter. You're getting launched. Nope, you're just gonna flop. What about you? Nope, you just flop as well. Right, I've got to do this for the, the highlight. <laughs> that was so perfect. <laughs> I just... <laughs> I just fucking launched her. Oh my god, that was perfect. Uh, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> oh my god, why why are you not getting launched? There we go. Oh my god, that was actually perfect. Oh, there we go. <laughs> And the beauty of this is, I don't get fined for it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hey, guard, guard. I've got a joke for you. I've got a joke for you. Once blue and gets launched, you. <laughs> and he's end up in the water. All right, uh, you. I'm launching you again. Oh, oh. Romlin Dreth. Any relation to Veil and Dreth from Oblivion? If so, you're a murderer. Oh, oh. Oh my god, I killed him. You see nothing. You, you see nothing. You see nothing. I, um. <laughs> I hope he wasn't important to any quest lines, um, because he's dead. Guard, you get, you saw nothing. <laughs> well, um, we were never here, right? We were never here. Yeah. Well, put a counter up of um, death through this spell. <laughs> Oops. Like, at some point, I'm just going to do an episode where I will literally just do a 30 minute episode. I won't talk at all in the episode. I will literally just spend 30 minutes launching people. And I might just do that for an episode. Maybe for like a 2K special or something. Like the launch episode. Oh. Oh, that gave me a good chuckle. Hi, Brynjolf. Um, there may have been a death outside the right way. Um, yeah, pay no mind to it. <laughs> yeah, and also, um, I've launched people into success. And death. Like, literally, I launched someone, they bent over backwards. Oh, my God. I'm actually nearly in tears. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. All right, who are they? Didava, Percy Honeyhound, and Hilda. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent Walking in front of me. Dafty. You as well, Vex? Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Hi, Delvin. How's it going? Consider it done. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. Right. And the goal is to not break the game. The key 
So I'm going to try and do it with the kind of optional tips they give me. Alright. Oh, and this time round we're not going to break the quest. And I really hope we don't break it this time because that was probably the funniest 10 minutes opening to an episode I think I've ever had in my life. That was <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, this book gives you a pickpocket. Because we kind of need to get a level up because I figured out that Barbus needs level 10 to spawn. And I'm only level one so we'll get to barbus in about 170 episodes hi lydia um i think guys we need to do the noble thing here we need to do the noble thing there we go we're doing the noble thing right It's just a floating away. And here, all we have is this dagger to remember him by. All right, so it's supposed to be our. Hi. Right, so we're not gonna break it this time. So I accidentally broke the quest last time because I killed. Bertie with Wabajack, and if you kill someone with Wabajack, it actually doesn't register as a death. So can I, interest you in I have a message from Brynjolf. What? Oh, it's one of you people. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother Simple. You don't pay, bad things happen. Dissuading are not going to sway me. You people are all protected. Everyone knows it. You demand payment for protection, and you can't even protect yourself. We can protect ourselves, trust me. I've launched people to their day. Alright, if you're not gonna. Then I'll just do this. My husband Bercy will be the death of me. He spends too much time worrying about this thing. There's no need to do that. Oh my word. You gonna pay? All right. So what am I supposed to do with this? Smash it. Hmm. Maybe if I had a. Perfect. There we go. You get a pay now. You gonna pay now? I'm gonna be honest. I've played this game for years and I've never done that. Thank you. Also, have a good day. Like I've played this game for years and that is genuinely the first time I've ever done that. So there's a first for everything. All right, be in Barb. Because uh, you've pretty much got one of three ways what to do it. Want? So, how would you meet Kirava? I met her when I wandered into Riften a few years ago. Been smitten with her ever since. In fact, I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. Oh, Lots awesome. Tradition dictates we present a potential mate a unique wedding ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band, but all I need are three flawless amethysts to complete the setting. Can't help you there. I understand. Hopefully I'll be able to save my meager earnings up to buy them one day. I'll just beat the crap out of her. Careful. I've already told that before. It was never a request. Out of here. Come back. Come on, give it your best shot. I'm not doing the three flawless. Like, it's gonna take forever. I'm just gonna beat the crap out of her and I'll let the YouTube comments berate me for it. Okay, pay me. Thank you. So 
Sorry, Talon J, but I'm not getting your ring sorted. Oh, I could buy another follower. Well, maybe another time. Anyway, we've got one more person to get. Hi, Shader. Bye, Shader. Hi, Guard. Bye, Guard. God, I love doing that. This is probably the most satisfying spell I think I've ever put into this game. Alright, um... Well, pay me and I won't. You know, you've been terrorizing the entire city. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the pin. Good, good. I'm glad we came to an understanding. Look, I got the message. Oh. <laughs> well, that was a bit anticlimactic. So let's just kind of flopped over and went, no. <laughs> All right, we did it. We, we did good, crew. We're very convincing people. We are very, very convincing. We know how to do our job. Anyway, we... Is there anyone else we could possibly launch? Hey, didn't ya? Didn't ya? You good? Up. Where'd you go? Oh. There she is. She's fine. Wait a minute. There we go. Go join whatever dreth it is. Oh crap, I think I've killed her. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Um She's just gonna continue swimming. Do you think she'll eventually run out of here and die? Nope, she's fine. Now she's just humping the stairs. Alright, let's go see Brynjolf and tell me did the thing. <laughs> oh god, I love this spell. It's the fact that I can pretty much just get away with killing people with it. Like, I just, I can launch someone, they could die, and the game would be like, nah, you're good, you're good. We actually don't... We didn't make this spell exist in the first place, so um, you're fine. You're Gucci fam. Alright, so um, Brynjolf did the thing. You proud of me? Yeah, about that. Here's what the orders. Yeah, about that. Um, I may have to have bury someone. Thank you. Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeeper, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Oh, crew! I think we've Not we're in. Last means in your blood, the telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. Before we go, I have to ask. What is your outfit do, isn't doing well? Lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Fair enough. Sounds good. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me, and I'll show you what we're all about. All right. So, what are we up to? Vigilance, don't climb on the furniture. Right, so now we've got to follow Brynjolf, who is about as fast as a granny on a walking stick with lead tied to her ankles. Let me show you the operation. Then you can ask your question. Oh wait, I could just launch him forward. That actually could be quicker. There we go. And there we go, he's at the door. It worked. That actually could be the strat. See if someone's been like really slow walking. Just kind of launch them forward a bit. Uh, 
Nice god, not you. Right, so keep going. Keep going, Brian Yolf. You're almost there, Paul. You're almost there. Okay, we made it. How's it going, Paul? Um, brought your friend here. Let's wait until you look like a bit of a twat. Just, you have a very twatty face. I don't know what it is. Like, what's with the mouth open? Mercer, this is the he looks as if he's about to, um, go down low, if you know what I mean. Uh... I like how I've just launched him. He's like, okay, right, that's fine. Alright, uh, crew, we're part of the Thieves Guild now. Do I make myself clear? <laughs> yeah, I understand totally. Um, totally listen to all of that. Ah, we'll be fine. Possesses an aptitude for our line of work, so let him. I suggest you listen to what Mercer has to say. Golden Blow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner, Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Um, I love how I'm just skipping all the dialogue by just launching them. Grimwald assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us in the end. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Thank you. Let's launch in celebration. Eh, uh, Brynjolf, you got anything for me? I'm expecting you to make us a lot of points, so don't disappoint me. So how do I get my cut the spoils? Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. Oh, that make me a bit difficult for my crew. Just saying. And they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tamelia in the plaza. She'll set you up with your new armor. Sounds like a plan. So, Golden Glow job. We raised the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Arangar. We need you to teach him a Right, so crew, we're not killing him. We're not gonna kill him. And clearing out the safe in the main house. What's the catch? The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Makes sense. Right. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What should I do about Arangoth? Arangoth remains alive, but if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. All right, crew, we are clear to kill. Right, we can kill him. You watch yourself on that island. Baby, how did I destroy the beehives? They're built like small. Besides, nothing tells the people. Okay, so basically, he's flame. All right. First of all, we'll go get our armor from Tanilla. Once we've got that, we're going to go to Golden Glow. We're going to do this. And in fact, while I'm at it, I'm going to put... Why oh, do I even have flame? Wow, do I really not have flame? It's quite a surprise. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. Right, Tanilla, where are you? In fact, if I do that and then do that... A marker. There's. No, that's Delvin. Oh, that's just get advice. Uh, here we go. Here's Tanella. Alright, so she's the fan, so she buys stuff. Yeah, can I get my armor? TikTok. There we go. Oh. Do my crew not get armor? Okay. Uh, let's see. These gold armor. How's you look? Like an absolute chad. Right, so I don't have the flame spell. I might make a quick stop. I think I'll make a quick stop over... To I need a magic shop. Is it a magic shop? Wanted to say something. I've never seen any I bothered uh, do you got anything? No. Right. I think I'll make a quick stop over to um try to think. White run. 
I'll head over to Dragon's Reach. Because Farangar should have spells. Because he's like the court wizard, so he should have spells. I'm going to very quickly do this. Get flames, and then we can go ham. And it turns out that we can kill, so... I think we know where this is going to go, troops. The Mad Lad crew is going to go on a spree here. Well, let's try and do it clean. We'll try to do it clean, but the comedy route is to basically make an absolute hash of it. So, do I go clean for style, or messy for the kind of the comedy side? Comedy. First, we'll go see Farangar and get flames. Thought I would have had the spell. Because I'm sure it's not like you get it in Helgen. Or, my, or is that maybe something else? That might be Sparks. And I don't want to chance it with Wabajack because, you know, Dramora. I just realised we haven't had a Dramora quarter for the episode yet. Uh, what have we got for sale? Have you got Flames? Books. Spell to them. Flames. Perfect. Thank you. Let me get flames. Did that about four episodes ago, pal. It didn't go well. Anyway, guys, let's head to Golden Glow. Uh, what it is, I'll set... That. Because I'd like to have Wabba Jack handy. Because I need to hit the Dramora quarter for the episode. So we'll go ham. See if we can hit it. Anyway, we're heading off to Golden Glow Estate. Let's do this. The beauty of fast traveling, because I keep forgetting that I've got all the locations unlocked. It just helps speed up the process, because I mean, no one wants 20 minutes of me walking somewhere. So I'm doing this for you, YouTube. You better be nice about it. Anyway, let's go ham and destroy some hives, and if there's guards about, we'll see if we can turn one into a Dramora for the, the quarter, right? Let's go, my mad lad crew! Oh, I can't go in. Guys, how do we feel about swimming? Wait a minute. Oh, dang it. Oh, you're right there. Alright, so now they're gonna... Hopefully, respond by opening the gate. Oh. Alright, Scootaloo. Wait a minute. Could we just jump out? Yes, we can. Alright, let's do this. We raid the Golden Glow Estate. Where are they? Wait, is... Is there a dragon nearby? Oh, you're dead. Oh, that's a lot of you. Can one of you turn to a Dramora, please? And I'm in the water. Oh my god, there's actually a dragon. Okay, so, um... Guys, new problem to deal with. We have a dragon. I can't get up here. There we go. Oh, oh my god, that dude tried to literally throw his nuts in my face. And I made you invisible. Uh-oh. Problem. 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 I don't know where you are. That worked. Um. So yeah, we seem to have a dragon problem on our hands. Right, I think the dragon's gone. Now I just got to deal with you. Oh, and there's a Dramora for the episode. We got him. And he's just disintegrated. We have the Dramora quarter for this episode. We did it. Oh no, it's God. Don't die on me. Yeah, I think we're good. Right, Scoot Luke, you're fine. Where's Vigilance? Could Vigilance not make it over? 
Right, we'll have to press off without him. First, we'll take the sweet roll. All right. Oh, there you are, Vigilance. Well done. All right, let's go. See, we don't do things the conventional way. And at least we've had a Dramora quota for the episode now. So we're good. All right, so we've got to take the key to Arangoth safe. But let's just go ham. Hi. Oh, oh no, it's God. Don't walk out in front of me, you dingus. Hey, we leveled up. Uh, any of you has got a key on you? No, you do not. All right. We'll just... I could probably pack this. See? I'm a pro. This is the way we're supposed to go, right? This is not the way. Guys, this isn't the door. I think it... Oh, yeah, it's here. All right, let's go. See, we're doing good. We're doing fine. We're not going to kill Iron God because, you know, we want to try and at least do this for style. Oh, we got a mess now. Or two. Up. Oh. Where'd the other one go? Oh, there he is. Good night. Right, we'll take his sailor key. Right, we're nearly there, troops. We've got this. We're doing great. I don't know where we're going. I think it's this way. Problem solved. Wait, wait, guys. Don't walk on this. Don't walk on this. Otherwise, you will die. Here's a safe. Oh, it's an expert safe. This could be a problem. This could be a problem. I've got 20 lockpicks and a dream. 19 lockpicks and a dream. Oh, oh. Right, we're, we're in the sweet spot. Like, we've... Oh, we got it. We did it. Guys, we cleaned out the safe. We're good thieves. Now we go through the sewer and get out of here and we're home free. We are the best thieves in the world. Oh yeah, I've got, I've got a level up to claim. Um, I'll take Magicka. Because I've got infinite health and stamina because of the whole Prince of Madness thing. Magicka is not infinite though. So we'll get more Magicka. Because I can't die and I don't run out of stamina. Alright, and we're free to head back. So. And the Thieves Guild has a little shortcut, if I remember correctly. I forget whereabouts. Like, I'm going to it, but I can't remember if it's like a... I think it's a pull chain. Uh, guys, you're kind of... Oh, I very nearly flame juice there. Oh yeah, I've got the button. Yeah, the pull chain's down here. But we did it! And we hit a Dramora quota for the episode, which I'm happy with. <laughs> I feel like if I don't get a Dramora in an episode, it's a bad episode. Brian, you all for did it. And here's what I'm to say. He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of the deal. And I'm certain oh yeah, and I didn't kill him, which is good. So, we did have a lot of style. This odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? No idea. Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. Okay. Oh, oh wait, I'm... I've got actually... No idea. Yada yada yada. Okay, so we're gonna meet Maven Blackbriar. What she want? Okay, so we're gonna go see Maven. 
and maybe a couple episodes time. Speaking of which, of course, you're paid. <laughs> you're smart as a whiplash. Keep doing right by us. Thank you. Fifty gold. I'm going to drown you. Nearly drowned you. Anyway, I think that will do it for an episode, my friends. Uh, we got quite a lot done. So, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. This was probably one of the funnier episodes I've done. And yeah, like we're now part of the Thieves Guild. Who'd have thought? So, next episode... Uh, well, the next video coming up... Uh, I actually don't know what will be yet, because this is actually the last episode for February. So, kinda, by the time this episode comes out, I'll have announced you know what's coming in March. And yeah... I hope you guys enjoyed it. We're definitely going to keep Skyrim going if by the time this episode goes out, this is still doing great. We'll keep it going because I'm loving it. Um, especially kind of launching people and not getting fined for it. It's just a lovely feeling. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you did. And until then, my friends, I will see you in the next one. Catch you later.